Hello YouTube, I've got this pretty special video coming up. Uh, I have four uh, Xbox 360s down here. They're all Xenons, and we're going to be testing them out today. So, they should be all in here. We got some packing peanuts here. I don't really like packing peanuts too much, but here's one in there. Pretty well wrapped, so that's good. Even with all the packing peanuts and stuff. There's the second. There's the third. And here's the fourth. And there they all are. So I'll go ahead and open them up and tell you guys about what like what kind there are and everything, because I know they're all xenons, but they're like, you know, different types and stuff. Alright, here they all are. Uh, I actually got sent one wrong one here. This one wasn't on the listing. There was supposed to be another 2005 one. So, I don't know if this is like... I don't know if this is like... It has the good GPU in it or not, but... Hey, I got this one, so... I don't know. They have another listing on their uh, eBay page where I got it from, and they had they had this console on here as well. So they they literally sent me the wrong console, but maybe if I buy the other one, then they'll give me the right console. I don't know, but it's you know it's cool. I don't really mind that too much. All right, so overview on the one that I just showed you. Uh, it's got the what the white uh, disc tray cover and eject button. USB door is gone. On the back here, manufactured uh, April fourth, two thousand eight. I don't know if that's a good GPU or not. It could be like on the tail end, um, but I'll show you guys the rest of them. All right, this one here should be the. Uh, 2005 one, and it is, and that, that's gross there, some sort of gunk there. Uh, December 7th, 2005, and they have your no display. So, so I guess these were tested at some point. I'll go get another. Here is the bone pile console. The faceplate's kind of coming off there, but that's that's okay. Um, as you can see here, maybe it might focus, 2007, October 4th, so this is a bone pile console, it doesn't make it more reliable, but, you know, it says display, but freezes, so, probably the GPU is going out on it, and I'll go ahead and grab the last console. Alright, we got the last console here, as the white chrome, or no, the, uh, white disc tray and eject button and turn it to the back here manufactured May 23rd 2006 and no testing sticker on the side so alright we'll go ahead and plug these in and test them out alright this is the 2008 console so let's go ahead and test it out it's fun for a little bit I think this is Either a capacitor issue or a uh, GPU issue. Oh, crap, hold on. Zero zero three one. Okay. Um, I think that might be like a power issue, of some sort. Uh, we'll go ahead and unplug it, replug it back in. I'll put the camera down here. Alright, and we'll, hmm, so I think, um, I think what I can do is, like, take a hair dryer and put it over the capacitors that are probably swollen in here, um, I know that's not, that's just a temporary fix, I've done it with the original Xbox before, uh, when I had to, when there was, like, a capacitor issue with it, I just put a heat, like, a hair dryer over it, and then I put it over the capacitors and everything, so, 
at least I don't know if this has a GPU issue or not, but you know, I'll go ahead and test out the next console here. All right, 2005 console opened up before, no faceplate and um, no display, so that means the GPU is going out on it. All right. Oh, dang. Oh, it's got the old dashboard. We can hear what it is. I don't know. I didn't hear anything. I just heard the I just heard it start up. Man. Can't get it open. Oh, it's coming out a little bit. Yeah, this is definitely crumbling. Oh god. Yep. Yeah, this is not good. Squeak. And the fans are getting louder, so I don't I don't really know. Uh, I don't want to leave you guys on the cliffhanger. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and get all of these consoles to boot up so that we can see what dashboards these are. So we're going to take note here. This one has an older dashboard. Could be NXE, could be Blades, who knows. Uh, Alright, let's test the next console. This is a bone pile console. I had to take the faceplate off because it was just not sticking at all. And yep, as you can see here, it's got the little, uh, what, the, uh, Sharpie thing on it. Alright, go ahead and turn it on here. Oh god. That sounded weird. Oh, dang. So yeah, it does freeze. And it is on a newer dashboard. This drive works and it's a Tachi drive. Nice. Uh oh. Come on. There you go. So, yeah. yeah. Well. Alright, we'll test the. Alright, here we go. Last console. It's already ejecting. It's not a good sign. Oh, it's booting. It actually is working, I guess. Hello? Hello? Uh oh. Oh, dang. What does that mean? E64. What does that mean? Hold on, I'll find that out. Alright, E64. Kernel DVD drive communications timed out. Replace data cable DVD drive. Replace DVD drive PCB. Replace South Bridge. Uh, so it could be a problem with the DVD drive, the cable to it, or something else. Has this thing ever been opened, or... No, it hasn't. That's good. That's a good sign right there. But then again, I've never seen anything like this on an Xbox E64. So, all right, I'll go ahead and test out all four of the consoles. Well, actually, well, we've already tested them out. We'll go ahead and um, get them so that they can boot, and we'll show the dashboard off. You know what, you guys? I'm going to tell you this. Uh, this get er, this video is getting uh, pretty long, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to split this off into two parts, and because this disassembly is taking a while. So thanks for watching, and also I paid a grand total of fifty eight dollars for these four consoles. That's a really good deal. I haven't had a deal like that in a while. Um, next video we're going to get. Every single console booted up. We're going to see what dashboards they're on. But I know the two older consoles have the older dashboards. And the Bone Pile console has either Connect or Metro. Um, 
If it's an older Kinect dashboard, then I might keep it because I'm looking for one of them. But if it's anything else, I think I'm just going to use it for parts. So thanks for watching.